What qualities do you admire most in others? The quality I most admire in others is their ter determination and never giving up in their goals that they have set in their lives. I look out and I see, think of Abraham Lincoln and how he had the goal of becoming president and he never went up he kept on going until he reached that goal. And that is the quality that has set in my life and that those type of people have laid in me. Thank you. So tell us, um, what event or experience outside of your high school have you enjoyed the most and why? The most enjoyable experience I have had was fulfilling my dream of becoming a lifeguard. The reason I wanted to become a lifeguard was because of the same importance the lifeguards had on my life I want to have on the children of today. The lifeguards that I grew up with made me feel like I was a part of their staff almost. I was the type of kid who was at the pool 24-7 during the summer. And it made me want to be like them because of their positive influence on my life. And words can't describe knowing that you're part of some kids' success in their stroke and their fear of overcoming water. And it's just my new passion that I have found in my life, and that is my most enjoyable experience outside of high school. Well, it's fantastic, especially for those of us who have little children who we want to save, so thank you. So tell us, who or what is the magic in the Spokane area? Please, Papa, ride the carousel with me, I said as a three-year-old, to my top exterior, yet teddy bear of a grandpa, who could not resist my who-like Cindy Lou's blue eyes, and replied, sure, let's go. I believe I was the only grandchild he rode the carousel with, but for me, it was truly a magical experience. Where does the magic come from? Who is it that puts the magic in Spokane? Why, of course, it is the magician, the dreamer, the people. People who have their dream create marvelous events and places throughout Spokane. People like Don Don Don, who started Bloom's Day and saw how he could bring the thrill and the excitement, not only to the competitive runners, but to the young and old, and even to the ones in wheelchairs. It's people like Louis Davenport who had a vision to create this enchanting place, the Davenport Hotel, so people may experience what it's like to live like kings and queens. Lilith Sears and Walt Peters performed their magic by starting the Lilac Parade in honor of our military and by giving them belief in the fantasy world for the children. I remember going to the parade as a little girl and always practicing the princess wave. Elbow, elbow, wrist, 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 with a thought, I'm a princess too, just like the true princesses on the float. The magic continued in people like Charles Ivy Luke, who made a place ideal for all ages, the carousel, and Bill Oliver, who saved it for the fun and entertainment at Riverfront Park. The magicians who were part of Expo 74, their dream? To make a park where kids could dream, and adults could dream of being kids again. Though I've only mentioned a few, all the magicians from yesteryear and today listened to the master magician and heeded the dreams given. So people like you and I may experience the magic of Spokane, the magic of being a kid again by riding the carousel, competing in Hoop Fest, running in Blue Stage, or simply feeding the dogs. I have many magical memories in Spokane due to all the magicians, but my favorite was my surprise 18th birthday party in the Ice Palace at Riverfront Park. Unexpectedly, the master magician surprised us with the rink to ourselves and granted me the chance to travel back to when I was a kid, chasing my cousins through the crowd. I received much more than the empty skate rink. I received the magic of being a kid again. The master magician, God in heaven, played his magic not only in my life, but in Spokane. He gave this area the four seasons, a 
tremendous river and fall, the tree, the mountain, the people, the dreamers, and yes, the magicians. As I look to the unknown future, I look toward God and ask, can I aspire such heights? A magician? Maybe we all can. Thank you. sponsored by Vista Utilities, is awarded to the candidate whose excellence in academics is calculated through high school honors classes for GPA, volunteer, and community service. This, year, this year's award is being presented by Judy Cole. 